Here we presents the top 5 best food processors. Starting at number 5, Ninja Auto Ick. Okay, in today's review, we're going to be taking a close-up look at the Nutri Ninja Auto Ick. Is it all it claims to be? Can it really tackle the tough stuff such as ice, nuts and frozen berries? Does it lives up to all the hype generated by the bloke on the infomercials, has it earned its place in the halls of fame, or is it another dud, designed to strip you of your hard-earned money, destined to sit unused while you find a better model? There is a lot of good that can be said about the Nutri Ninja Auto IQ, in terms of its entry-level price and smoothie performance tests. To use the blender, one simply fills one of the provided cups with ingredients being careful not to overfill. The Auto IQ comes with 30 recipes you can use, or you can be inventive and create your own masterpiece. Assuming you've added ice and selected the Ultra Blend setting, the blender will go to work over the next 60 seconds blending, pulsing and pausing. The brief pause allows for heavier objects to make their way down to the extractor blades, before repeating the process, ensuring a smooth consistency. When all said and done, the Nutri Ninja Auto IQ isn't a bad machine in my personal opinion. Now that I have armed you with the positives and pitfalls of the machine, you should have a firm idea if the machine is for you. If you don't mind pulling out the gasket ring every now and again, and are happy to replace the cups should the tabs wear thin, the Nutri Ninja Auto IQ is defiantly worth consideration. The result you achieve blender are great for what you pay. For those not quite sold on the Ninja, I can highly recommend the Vitamix S30. It's my favorite blender and the one I have been using for the past year. It's never let me down and creates anything I place before it be it smoothies, hot soups, crushed ice for cocktails or salsa. For more information and price, check out the product links in description. At number 4. Cusner DLC 10 SYP1. The Cusner DLC 10 SY Pro Classic Food Processor could not be considered a workhorse, but this medium-duty machine costs only around $100. It's a considerable step up from your basic food shoppers, and it offers some nice features without the giant price tag of the high-end machines. This model is a 7-cup food processor that includes attachments for chopping, slicing, shredding, and mixing. A dough blade is not included, but it has an extra wide feed chute and also comes with a flat cover for processing without the feed tube. Keep in mind that this is not a high-dollar food processor, and there are limitations to several of the above items. One is that the included slicing disc cuts 4mm slices, which is extremely thin. That can be perfect for carrots, celery, and zucchini, but it's not so great for tomatoes. Foods with high water content will process better with the 8mm slicing disc, but that does not come with the unit and must be purchased separately. The manual provided by Cusinerd is somewhat generic, labeled only DLC 10s, but it is illustrated and provides a considerable amount of information. You'll find tips for getting the best results with various processing tasks, as well as photos showing how to pack the feed chute with foods of different shapes and sizes. A good number of recipes are also included. It offers good value for the price, when you consider the features and attachments it has to offer. It is uniquely made, and performs many tasks effectively, so it is a must-have processor in the kitchen. Halfway of my listed number 3. Hamilton Beach 70740. The Hamilton Beach 8 Cup 70740 food processor packs a powerful punch, whipping through food preparation tasks quickly. For a compact model, it's one of the best food processors we reviewed. It performed especially well in our cookie dough tests, we mixed softened butter, an egg and dry ingredients, and the Hamilton Beach thoroughly blended them together, producing dough with an excellent texture in less than a minute. We also had good luck slicing potatoes. We ended up with uniform pieces that could cook nicely or bake well in any recipe. This Hamilton Beach model has some good selling points. For one thing, it has a sturdy suction cup on the bottom, located toward the back, that really anchors it to the countertop. Our test results were a mixed bag. We shredded cheddar cheese, and it turned out fairly well. Since the bowl is relatively small, some already shredded cheese tends to build up on one side near the chute, which keeps cheese coming through the chute from shredding into uniform pieces. Some cheese was also trapped between the chute and the outer rim of the lid. Parmesan cheese fared even worse. It wasn't very finely grated, and there were extra pieces that didn't get grated at all. 
We tried to puree cauliflower with a bit of water and got uneven results there. The same happened in our efforts to chop almonds. Onions ended up being more pureed than chopped since they were chopped so finely. The resulting pieces were not very uniform, stuck to themselves, and were too small. If you want genuinely diced onions, cube shaped and smaller than chopped, but bigger than minced. The Hamilton Beach 8 Cup 70,740 works great for certain kitchen tasks, including kneading and slicing firm vegetables, but it produces varied results with other foods. For more information and price, check out the product links in description. Coming in at number 2. Hamilton Beach 70,725 A highly effective food processor can easily transform the quality of your cooking, and this Hamilton Beach 70,725 model has the capability to change the way you prepare food forever. With a large capacity and speedy chopping functionality, the processor leaves you wondering how you ever managed to cope without one. But before you make your decision on buying one of the many food processors on the market today, take the time to read our in-depth review. So, what makes the Hamilton Beach 70725 stand out amongst the competition? Why have we rated it so highly? Some of the product's key features are explained below, though we suggest that you approach these with your own set of criteria in mind to evaluate if it truly is the best product for you. As we have previously stated, the Hamilton Beach 70725 is extremely easy to operate, and this is mainly due to the three settings that the machine has. At the front of the product you will notice four buttons and you simply press the one that performs the function you are after. If you are unsure which one is best for your purpose then the instructions provide clear guidance. As a starting food processor, there are very few alternatives that operate as straightforwardly as this model, meaning that it is suited to a wide range of users. In addition, the Hamilton Beach 70725 is also easy to assemble. Many food processors come with parts that twist into place, and these can become fiddly and messy, particularly when liquids and other wet foods are placed in the processor. The 70725, by contrast, has a stack and snap assembly function which clicks into place really easily and removes any difficulty. It is, however, worth bearing in mind that the lid is not liquid tight and therefore spillages could occur if it is too full of liquid. We think that the Hamilton Beach 70725 is a superb food processor that completes the job quickly and easily. The unit can be kept in a relatively small area of space and is one of the easiest processors out there to use. It requires minimal effort to clean as the parts of the processor are all dishwasher safe, saving you time and energy. On the other hand, the processor is relatively noisy in comparison with others out there, and we would suggest that it may not be the most attractive piece of kitchen equipment that you will own however, it is a great processor for the price and will easily get the job done with very little fuss. And number 1. Ninja BL770. There's probably nothing better than the ability to make a customized dessert or a delicious cup of smoothie from the comfort of a home, which is where the Ninja BL770 comes in handy. This appliance conveniently moonlights as a blender and food processor. It also boasts an impressive performance that allows it to make perfect nutrient laden smoothies, soups, and purees in a fine consistency. Since I heard a lot about the super blender from my friends, I decided to test it for my personal use. The Ninja BL770 boasts an extremely powerful 1500 watt motor that meets the user's food processing and blending needs in a matter of second. This saves homeowners a lot of food preparation time and allows them to spend more time enjoying their food or smoothie. It also comes with multiple blade options and containers, facilitating its functions both as a blender and food processor. The Ninja BL770 also comes with five different speed settings including high, medium, low, pulse, and single serve, which facilitates different blending and food processing functions. Besides the multiple blades and containers that make the Ninja BL770 a versatile device, it comes with a one-of-a-kind auto IQ function that works with all the speed settings and pulse function. Basically, this feature activates pulses in a unique pattern that allows it to blend and pause intermittently until the ingredients are smooth. I have included these product link in the description. You can check out this link for more information and latest price. Thank you for watching this video. Please hit the like button, share with your friends, and be sure to subscribe.